trip, but when Dennis announced that it cannot be parsed with ordinary understanding. What is cognition? Well, cognition, I think, in its most basic sense, is knowledge or knowing. When you cognize something, you understand it, you grok it. There may be a, a metaprogram running of some kind here where it's become important for us to expand human cognition, to expand human cognition in order to get us out of the mess we're in. They did take a little psilocybin. Together, 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 together. Of course, uh, we as we are, are too stupid to survive. Humanity as it is today is doomed, that's for certain. But it doesn't necessarily have to stay as it is today in the evolutionary leap. What precipitated major cultural bifurcations in the past? And how can we intentionally intervene in history so as to create a different future? At this point in time, the uh, recent computer revolution has given a huge boost to our collective intelligence. And uh, that may lead in a short time, a matter of generations, to a completely different species that would have a future, at least have a longer future, buying time for yet another evolutionary leap. such an intolerant narrow system at the moment that um, I think one way of opening it up is to bring the principle of democracy into science. It's never been there before. It's the one institution in modern life which has no democratic input. Uh, it's the one totally top-down institution and the way it's organized in Western countries is no different from the way it was organized in the Soviet Union. It's a kind of run by central committees, supreme Soviets as it were. Um, and uh, I just think this form of organization is outmoded. The experiments and practice and development of our visual intelligence, visual language as it were, this could be uh, extremely important for the future of our species. A, a retreat from the brink of a historical apocalypse created by overpopulation and resource abuse and uh, untrammeled militarism and dominator polity.